Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to remove a Windows 10 computer from a domain. In the previous video, we showed you guys how to add a Windows 10 computer to a Windows Server 2022 domain controller. It's a bit of a tongue twister. If you wanna see that video, click in the corner right here. Now, before we get started, as always, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server, remote desktop licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so here we are on Windows 10 desktop. We can see that we're on the um, enterprise evaluation. The home editions of Windows 10 do not support joining Active Directory. So if you don't have a commercial edition of Windows 10, then you're probably not joined. But anyways, this is a fairly simple process. We just need to go to this PC, which we can type into search. And we're kind of going to do the reverse of the last steps that we did in, um, and we're just going to do the reverse of what we did in the last video. So right click on this PC and we'll hit properties. And in this case, we're going to hit rename this PC advanced. Uh, since I'm on the enterprise evaluation, I'm not sure it'll look exactly the same, but you're basically looking for change this settings or rename this PC or something along those lines. Uh, so we do that and then we can click change here on the right side. And we're just gonna switch this to workgroup instead of domain. In all caps, we can type in workgroup. And then maybe I just wanna change the computer name as well to, and so with those changes made, I'll hit okay. This is gonna prompt us for a restart, which will then make this all take effect. Uh, oh, we're not allowed to use those characters, so I'll just put Gabe windows okay now it says welcome to the work group work group you must restart the computer to apply these changes i'll hit okay there and restart now all right and we're back on our login page our option to switch to the other user to log into the domain is no longer there which means that we have successfully removed this from the domain all right guys so that's going to do it for today's video if you have any questions about any parts of this process drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible Again, if you're interested in genuine Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll put links down below. Lastly, a like and subscribe would mean the world to us as it helps us to make more videos like these. We also strongly encourage any video topic ideas that you might have. And again, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.